He is the most unpopular US president of modern times. But Joe Biden's Democrats have achieved a historically good set of results. It was a good day, I think, for democracy. And I think it was a good day for America. He lost fewer seats in the House of Representatives than any Democratic president's first midterm election in the last 40 years. And we had the best midterm for governors since 1986. He is savoring some rare good news. Hey, buddy, Joe Biden, congratulations, man. Congratulations. Especially with doubts over whether a man who turns 80 in 10 days' time will run for re-election. Hey, Gov, congratulations. My intention is that I run again. But I'm a great respecter of fate, and uh, this is ultimately a family decision. My guess is it'll be early next year we make that judgment. Another possible candidate for the 2024 race is holed up at his Mar-a-Lago resort. After many of Donald Trump's candidates failed to make waves, there are reports he is angry and wounded, especially after the success of his Republican rival, Florida Governor Ron DeSantis. Counting continues in Nevada and Arizona for two Senate seats which could decide who has control of the upper house. In Phoenix, Arizona, far from Washington, views on the next occupant of the White House are mixed. I don't know. I really hope Trump doesn't run. I'd like to see him get indicted, but as for Biden, I don't know, kind of indecisive. But. I'm not saying I'm a Trump supporter. Like, you're not going to see me with a MAGA hat on. But I think he's better than Joe Biden. Joe Biden's much older. Who should we be watching? I, Ron DeSantis, without a doubt. Ron DeSantis set himself up last night. Whilst it could be a few more days before we have the final results here, nationwide there are clear and consequential trends. And the balance of power, particularly in the Republican Party, seems to be shifting. As the electability of one contender and the candidacy of another are being questioned, it is very possible the old guard will soon be replaced with new faces.